as you can see, that Halo does not play like any other um, shooter before, before this game came out. <clears throat> Basically, I made this video um, just to show you that, I mean, pretty much I made this video just to show everyone that Halo is not like a generic shooter. What I mean about generic shooters, like similar gameplay to what Doom, Duke Nukem 3D, or Half-Life did. How, how can I describe how Halo plays? Well, basically, it does have that traditional first-person shooter gameplay, but pretty much Bungie, they kind of like, they made it more strategic in their own style, which pretty much back then, when you like play Doom and then you jump back to Halo, it plays very like different to other shooters. <coughs> Basically, um, I do not think, um, you know, Halo has the best storyline or anything. That's really pretty much, um, on my opinion. And a lot of people say that Half-Life <laughs> is the best FPS game ever created. Well, that's your opinion. For me, I thought it was a good game. And yeah, it, it's definitely awesome. Because I, I remember playing that game. I, I enjoyed the atmosphere a lot and all that stuff. But it really did play like play like Doom to me, except it was just more puzzles, and I really don't like puzzles, so yeah, that's one of the reasons why I don't really enjoy Half-Life as much compared to Halo. <coughs> oh yeah, a lot of people say that, um, I mean actually a lot of uh, Half-Life fanboys say that Halo doesn't have as much content to um, Half-Life. That's not true. Yeah, Half-Life got mods and all that stuff, but when I play a game, I want to like, I want to focus on the developer's talent. I want to focus what, what the dev, what um, the developers did for the campaign mode. So basically, mods, mods, multiplayer are all useless to me, pretty much. Speaking of multiplayer, I really don't like how Halo's labeled as a multiplayer game nowadays. <laughs> I mean, when you grew up playing Halo Combat Evolve, you'll definitely like spend a lot of time playing single player more than multiplayer. <coughs> you see? You see? Watch this. I'm gonna play like Half Life, which means no melee, no grenades, just using my gun. And basically, I just died. So basically, it's pretty much impossible to like to play like Half Life or you play Halo One. <coughs> Oh yeah, what um, Halo actually did, what most shooters don't do nowadays, is like, the weapons, they're not as strong as, as weapons to other first person shooters. So this pretty much like creates uh, like a lot of more strategy, strategy involved. Usually when I play this level, I would like throw two grenades, pull out my assault rifle and take down those two elites. But right now I think it's too late to do it. Well, let me try it. Yeah, I guess it's kind of too late. Well, maybe not. <laughs> so you guys can see, it doesn't really like, play like like Half-Life or Doom or Quake, Duke Nukem 3D, Soldier of Fortune, etc., etc. Pretty much um, created its... Halo pretty much created its own style going, pretty much. <coughs> Which is the reason why I really enjoy this game. <coughs> Basically, I think you guys should really, like, give this game another chance if you think it's a generic shooter. Try to play it on Heroic or Legendary. I mean, when you play this game on normal, yeah, it does feel like a generic shooter at times. But if you play it on heroic or legendary, you might get a different result. So, yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. Um, I won't be posting any um, new videos for a while because I'm playing Bullet Witch right now. The game is fun, actually, despite of all the bad reviews it got. I think I might make a review about it. 
Yeah, you know what? In the future, I might make reviews of my favorite games just for fun. Well, see you guys later.